Watch Guard Capital. Invest your time wisely. This is GameStock, a Fortune 500 company that sells new and pre-owned video games and accessories. This is Wall Street Bets, a Reddit discussion forum where 8 million degenerates, their words, not mine, get together and share investing ideas. One of those degenerates, Deep F***ing Value, has an investment philosophy of YOLO and hold and turned approximately $60,000 of GameStop investments into $50 million over the past year when the price increased from $4 to $400 at one point last week. Deep F***ing Value noticed that hedge funds had taken on too much risk when they shorted all GameStop's outstanding shares, which means they borrowed shares from other people and sold them, which positioned them to make money if GameStop's price went down and positioned them to make 100% return if GameStop's stock went bankrupt, which up until that point had been a very proven strategy. But when you borrow other people's shares, you have to return them at a later date and time, which is not good if the price went up, which is what happened to this guy who runs that fund. He lost billions when he closed out a short position last week, and so did a lot of other people who were selling GameStop shares they didn't own. Because many people who were buying shares weren't doing so because it's a good investment, they just wanted to see how much pain they could squeeze out of those shorters. Which brings me to the Q&A section. Are shorters bad? No, they're absolutely necessary to keep untethered market optimism in check. Is GameStop a good investment? Maybe, but probably not at these prices. Should I invest in a hedge fund? Maybe, but most of the time hedge funds are private and will probably be reassessing how much risk they take on now that these Reddit raiders are looking for their next target. Okay, that's it for me for now. I'm Steven with WatchGuard Capital. Subscribe to my channel to see my other financial videos.